<laughs> That's perfect. That's fuck, I love it. human being right at this second so I got the flu um, I did that question thing on Instagram where you like ask questions but there are quite a lot so I thought I would answer some here as well excuse my flu voice this is just this is what's happening oh my god right beanies they're up <laughs> so if you're watching this which you are uh, these beanies from riftsupplyco.com which is my uh, clothing brand they're available now I'm so chuffed with these, they're super warm. How sick is that? Uh, I have a massive head and they fit my head and my friend has a tiny head and it fits her head, so this is great. We have free shipping on orders over $75 if you're in Australia. Got this really cool like knit pattern that I designed, like not to suck my own dick, but I love these. <laughs> okay, back to the question. Are you religious or spiritual at all? Um, I find it very difficult to align myself with any kind of religion. <laughs> That's pretty much it. I'm not anti-religion and I definitely wouldn't call myself an atheist, but I'm not like I'm not guided by any Religion in my daily life. Is Borger better at Hungry Jack's or KFC? Borger is better at Ben's Burgers. You should know this. Do you smoke meats like the Zuck? I have fucking no idea what that means. Hey bitch, don't have a queue, but been a fan since Ruckus like thank you That is a long ass time. Best beach on the north side of Brisbane. Probably Noosa Heads. That's quite north. Do you mean the whole country? If you mean all the way north, then probably like Whitehaven Beach. Opinion on toes. I got some. When's the next video? You're watching it, bud. <laughs> what makes you decide to go with or without shoes for the day? Literally, if my socks are too far away or if my shoes are too far away, I just won't wear them. If I just don't have the patience, I won't bother wearing them, which is most of the time. <laughs> I grew up in a small, like, coastal-ish town and no one wore shoes. I have in the past had some very concerned people, either from Australia or outside of it, I don't really know. They've sent me basically dissertations on why I should wear shoes and how I'm just gonna die if I don't. I don't understand understand that like unless you're living somewhere really grotty or you're walking on glass 
wearing shoes is not good for you. And I'm not doing it for the health benefits. It's just sometimes I genuinely just don't want to put my shoes on. But that should be fine. Like wearing shoes is worse for your body unless you are stepping on something that shouldn't be going in your foot. Has happened. <laughs> a few times but you know what that's character building <laughs> favorite thing about living in australia not having to wear shoes and it not being weird all right i'm fresh out of water and i'm fresh out of fucks because i just want to go to sleep i hope you guys like this video i had a really good time at splendor um despite the fact that i got the flu if you like this video give it a thumbs up and leave a comment and help my sick ass out i got a few shout outs to give this week um if you didn't know i give shout outs every single video to people who put the notification bell on leave a comment letting me know that they've done it wow i also give shout outs to people who are really active on my instagram and like comment on my stuff all the time and are really lovely like that and also recently to people who order things from Rift just so I can say thank you to you guys. First up from the Rift shout outs we've got AJ Moran and also Brit who left in the order notes that she does lettering art. Her Instagram is ninja near 22 so check that out if you're into that. From Instagram we have Hannah Young, Lily Horrigan, um, Xander Pandre, Xander Pandre, I don't know bro but thank you. <laughs> and last but not least from YouTube we have Marty Spock, Carlos Basualdo, Basualdo. Names are a lot easier to read than they are to say I'm very quickly learning. And last but not least, Hellcat. Sick name. Thank you guys so much, I really appreciate it. Um, also thank you to everyone who came and said hello to me at Splendor. It was really nice meeting you guys. A little bit of life advice, don't go to a festival for four days, not brush your hair the whole time and then come back with the flu. Nah, it was worth it though.